Here's how to connect Perplexity to your NAN workflow. So first you wanna open up a basic NAN workflow, and then we're gonna go ahead and search for Perplexity. We'll just use the message or model node. From here, we want to go to where it says credential to connect with and click on create new credential. We're gonna to need to enter in an API key. To find our API key, we need to go to Perplexity. So I'll have a link in the description down below for this. You wanna log in or create an account if you don't already have one. And then you want to go to the bottom left where you see account and then go to where you see API. And that's gonna ask you to create a new API group. So let's go ahead and enter in, I'm just gonna say YouTube tutorial for this. You can name it whatever you want. The description doesn't really matter. And then it's gonna want you to enter in a address. Then you wanna go ahead and click on where it says save. And then it's gonna ask you to add a payment method to buy API credits. So what we need to do is add in a payment method. And once you add a payment method, you wanna to go to where it says buy more credits. And for this example, I'm just gonna buy $5 worth of credits. Click on confirm. And so now we should be able to access our API key. So if we go to the bottom left where it says API keys, if we click on accept terms and generate API key, we can enter in a key name. You can name this whatever you want. I'm just gonna name it test key. I'm gonna click on create key and then click on the copy button. This is gonna copy this key to our clipboard, in which case we can go back to our workflow and paste in that API key right here. And then if we click on where it says save, it should say that the connection tested successfully. We can go ahead and close out of that. Now we can actually go ahead and just test it out to make sure it works. We can say, what is the tallest mountain in the world? Then click on execute step. And it should do a search using the sonar model. If we go to the schema over here, we can see all the citations as well as all of the search results it has performed. We can actually see the content of it as well. The concept of the tallest mountain can be understood in different ways, depending on how measurements are taken. And then it'll tell us that Mount Everest is the highest mountain in the world. That is basically how you can perform a search using perplexity. That's how you can connect it to your workflow. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments down below, or you can check out my NAN community in the description down below. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope this helped you out.